Tracy, you are exceptional. I have to go through this list. Tracy has sacrificed a kidney to save a stranger's life, donated 16 eggs to three couples to let them have babies, 80 pints to the National Blood Bank, and you've enrolled on a stem cell donor register to give hope to cancer patients. Well, of which begs the question, I mean, there's kindness and there's kindness. What motivates you? Why? Um, there's no great secret behind it. I just think if you have the opportunity to do something good, then you should take that opportunity. But it's, it's to complete strangers, Tracy. So I think a lot of people will say, well, you know, I could imagine donating a kidney to my husband or, or child or a member of my family. But, but you are doing this for complete strangers. You don't even know who they are sometimes. And maybe at risk to yourself as well. Well, yes. I mean, giving a kidney, obviously, it's, you know, it's a big operation, but the, the workup that you have, the medical workup, ensures that you are as healthy as possible. So that minimises the risk. But it, I don't think it matters whether it's to a stranger or somebody you know. If you can, if you can help somebody, well, why not? It, well, as you say, if you can help somebody, why not? Goodness me. But when you give, how does it make you feel? It's a nice feeling. It's a nice feeling to know that there's somebody that you've helped. Um, but my kidney is just a tiny part of it. Obviously, there's, there's a whole team involved, the surgeons, the nurses, everything else. So it, I'm just contributing one part of that. But, there are but, always but, risks involved, Tracy, yes. with, with surgery. So do you ever worry for your own health and your safety? Because what about you're, your family? you're considering whether to become a liver donor, we hear. I am thinking about it. That's a much bigger operation than donating a kidney, so I need to put an awful lot of thought into that. So it's at the back of my mind, but I haven't decided yet whether I'm actually going to head with that one. Tracy, let, let, help us understand this, because you, you are an amazing person. Either you're an amazing, selfless person or you're slightly addicted to this. What is it? <laughs> Well, as part of the medical workup to donate a kidney, you have to have a full psychiatric evaluation. So they have to make sure that you understand the risks and that you're donating for the right reasons. So I, I, I don't know. I just there's, I don't know anyone with kidney failure. I just I read about it in the newspaper and I thought I could do that, and um, went ahead with it. There's no. You know, there's no deep, meaningful reason why I did it. I just thought it was a nice thing to do. Well, you, you are amazing. You're a good, a good, good person, Tracy. And listen, um, we know Eamon was saying there you're thinking of, of becoming a liver donor, so we wish you well with that, and whoever receives Lovely that will be very lucky. Lovely talking to you. Thank you. Thank you, Thank you, very you much. Tracy. Um,